How are you guys? Welcome to another video. Today I want to do a front and sort of refresh upgrade just because it looks very stock <laughs> the front end at the moment. Not aggressive at all. It just looks like some grandma's city. This time my mom's car. <laughs> so I've got a couple of things I want to chuck on. First is this lip. Sort of been sitting in the back of a few videos. And it's a Mugen style lip. And I have some amber corner lights as well. Like the JDM rare models get. But I've just got some eBay ones that are much cheaper. So I'll unbox these and we can start chucking them on the car. Let's start with this front lip. Because I've been waiting a while for this. doesn't fit great, really have to pull the sides in a lot. So we look at the corner lights. Looks alright. I think it was $60 for a set. Light bulb's supposed to go inside the socket. On the new one. Won't fit. Finally got the light in. I had to grind around the outside of the light. Looks so much better. It's a new one. New old one. Now I have both of the new side markers in. So much better. Now I just gotta tackle putting the lip on.
Aha. Last thing I want to fix up on this front end is the license plate holder. You can see how rusty it is. So I'm going to clean it on the wire buff and give it some paint. I have some yellow tint here that I'm going to tint these headlights. Some of the models came with yellow fog lights, so I've got two of these sheets for five dollars and I'm just going to have a go at making my own one instead of spending $150-$200 on eBay. So just I'm going to clean the surface first with some wax and grease and then I'm going to put it on. Hopefully I don't have to use the heat gun because it's relatively flat, should be quite easy to install. Okay, that's it for another video. I'm very happy with the new side markers, even though I had to grind them to make them fit. But it was 
much cheaper than buying real ones. And the lip. The lip looks really cool and aggressive. I did have some issues with gaps along here, so I had to put uh, another screw underneath. But apart from that, didn't take too long to install. Didn't have to take the wheels off, just half an hour. So, look forward to my next video. Should be servicing the car. Like, comment, subscribe. See you next time.